Hello, I'm Wade Wilson in the newsroom with some breaking stories. First, those of you waiting for Doc Johnson's new book to drop, the wait is over. The book is available now on savingzickfish.org. Sources say there are numerous book tours and introductions to what the book actually contains. According to purchasers of the book, it's pretty good. Sarah has more. Sarah? Thanks, Wade. Sources here say the book is loaded with QR codes that lead to additional and more detailed video resources, downloads. There's even going to be an internet message board to help the author stay in touch with readers. We talked with some of the early purchasers of the book. And they say, this is the kind of book you could give a kid. And he'd be proficient enough to work at a pet store the next day. No doubt. According to another reader, I got the book down in three hours. I knew enough to be dangerous and figured out what was wrong with my fish tank in minutes. All in all, this book seems to be a fast track to reasonable fish health proficiency. What took Dr. Johnson 30 years to learn? Can be taught to the average tropical fish hobbyist in three hours. Back to you, Wade. Thank you, Sarah. That's a pretty awesome laboratory down there, isn't it? If you don't have a copy of the book, the newsroom has found a bunch of copies for sale at savingzickfish.org. And the list price is $24.99. But with shipping, which is included in the prices, the total for most domestic shipments is $30. According to someone we talked to at the office down there, they're not shipping paper copies of the book outside the United States. But the electronic version is available for printing all over the globe. There are a variety of shipping methods and speeds. If you need the information in the book immediately, then the printable electronic version might be the best choice. From what we understand, there is no downloadable version. Let's go to Dr. Johnson himself for a few words to wrap up this story. Dr. Johnson? Thanks, Wade. This is Dr. Johnson, a veterinarian in Marietta, Georgia. I just wanted to talk to you briefly about the new book. It's out, Saving Sick Fish. To figure out what its utility would be, this would be a book that I would hand to somebody who just got a fish tank didn't know anything about fish tanks and didn't want to be baby talked, but wanted the shortest course between not knowing much of anything and being able to handle most things that come your way. Or I would take this book and I would hand it to somebody that wanted to go to work at a pet store. This could become a training manual for everybody at the major pet store chains. And you just go, here's a 40 page book, read this cover to cover and be prepared for some basic questions coming off of that. And if they could handle that, they would be practically ready for almost anything. Um, these are the big working pieces and they're not just randomly chosen low hanging fruit of things to talk about. They're actually very relevant to success with fish. And if you, uh, like I said, as a potential reader, if you took this book and read it uh, cover to cover, sitting around one afternoon, I think that you'd end up being uh, very well served. So this is basically the way the book is, is uh, laid out. It's full color and there are QR codes on each page, uh, almost all the pages. There's one right there. I don't know if you can scan it, but there's uh, QR codes on each page. QR codes on each page that'll take you to some uh, different resources. There's uh, how to set up an irrigation system for your tanks, um, tank cleaning, viruses, parasites, quarantine, medications, fungus, bacterial infections. Uh, aeration and more aeration, how much you should feed, how to tell when you're feeding too much or too little, um, some water quality parameters and easy ways to manage them. And um, it's all in all, it's about 40 pages long. And like I said, it will bring you up to speed in a very short period of time. And like I said, this is the book that you would give to somebody who's a beginner and wanted to know a lot, somebody that was getting ready to work at a pet store or garden center and you wanted them to be caught up on the basics and not just superficially, but actually usefully up on the basics. It's, uh, I wrote it, it with uh, the fireman and the librarian in mind, basically the idea that somebody who's certainly intelligent, but doesn't have any background in the area could learn a lot in a short period of time and not waste a ton of extra words on, uh, well, just a ton of extra words. This is really pared down. Hope you like it.